Smileys. It's AI. It's AI. <laughs> wait. Okay, wait, wait, stop. That's enough. Hey, Smileys. Welcome back. It's AI, and this is AI Brown Smile. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. Can you guys believe that we are just a few short weeks away from Christmas? Mind blown. Okay, so I haven't finished all of my shopping yet, but I'm definitely getting into the Christmas spirit. I got my poinsettia. Isn't it beautiful? I'm wearing my Christmas socks. Aren't they cute? Got a little penguin on them. Love it. But you wanna know what's not cute? What's hiding underneath? So stay tuned, smileys. <laughs> so, so, so stay tuned, smileys. I'm going to give myself a pedicure that's long overdue, and I'm going to show you how I do that from home. Hey, hey, smileys. I'm really looking forward to this pedicure and it's surely needed. I'm just being honest. Today I'm using this Petty Spa Detox System by Gina. I picked it up at Sally's and I've never really used it before, but once I saw that it was infused with charcoal, I was sold. Definitely sold. I'm crazy about charcoal right now and if you haven't seen my video on why I absolutely love activated charcoal, make sure you check it out. But anyway. This kit has four steps that you'll see me use later in the video. There's a soak, a scrub, a mask, and a moisturizer. I started with nail prep because preparation is the key to success. And it's a pretty important part of the pedicure process or any nail care for that matter. As you can see here, I treat my toenails much like I treat my fingernails. I start with a trim to get my desired length. Then I use a nail file to achieve the shape that I want and to smooth the edges of my nails. Then I clean them with an orange stick and finally push back my cuticles, which ultimately makes the nail and nail bed appear a little longer. It's never a good idea to cut your cuticles, although some people do. Avoid that if you can and gently push them back instead. Finally, I buff my nails to give them a nice smooth surface, which also helps the nail polish go on more smoothly as well. Yay, I get to use my Conair Foot Spa. It was only $20 at Walmart, you guys, and it's well worth it if you ask me. It has heat, vibration, and bubbles. So here I'm just adding some hot water and turning it on. And as you can see, the bubbles start right away. It's a lot of fun. Step one of our kit is the Detox Foot Soak, which deeply cleanses the feet while calming and relieving the skin. I'm going to allow my feet to soak for about, it says five to 10 minutes. Before we move on to step two. Step two is the detox purifying scrub, which diminishes calluses and exfoliates dry skin. I just apply the scrub and smooth it all over both feet and my lower leg, and then I rinse and towel dry. Now on to step three. This detox nourishing mask draws out deep dwelling impurities and replenishes the skin with moisturizers. I apply a thin layer to both feet and wrap them with plastic to lock in that moisture. After about 10 minutes, I use a hot wet towel to remove the mask and my feet feel amazing. The final step is the Detox Emollient Massage Cream. This conditions dry cracked skin and soothes for an ideal foot massage. Now my feet aren't that bad to where they're cracking, but apparently this works for people who have feet that are. Okay, here I'm applying my base coat and I'm just using an OPI clear coat to do that. And I'm keeping it simple with my color tonight and using this wet and wild cute shimmery polish. It's called Break the Ice. It's very cute. I 
I just follow it up with a top coat and we're all done. This kit was about $15 at Sally's, like I mentioned, and I absolutely loved it. And you will too if you give it a try. My feet feel and look great and love you guys. That'll do it for today, smileys. Mwah. <laughs> what exactly is going on here? Take a guess and put it in the comments. See you guys next time.